Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we are the Unchefs, Bill, Ron, Nick, and what we've got for you tonight are our, as promised, Grub Rub Burgers with some spicy smashed potatoes. Very, very good. They are very, very good. Now, we're going to do the potatoes first today because they're going to take the longest to cook. Now, we have uh, already chopped some potatoes up and semi-peeled them. Uh, we're going to leave some of the skin on because uh, it's protein, nutrients, uh, it's good for you. Anyway, so we're just going to throw these in, boil them for about 20 minutes or so, and uh, we'll be back with you <laughs> sometime after that. Bump it down! I'm now going to proceed to smash these potatoes into smashed potatoes. So while Ron is smashing the taters, we're going to come over to Nick who is going to I'm gonna rub the meat. I am the uh, resident meat rubbing expert, so I have my grub rub meat mix right here. Ah, Kester Farms grub rub. It is amazing stuff. I have my lean beef right here. That's a uh, ground sirloin. Ground sirloin. Don't worry about that. Hey, on chefs. That's how right. we do. We Absolutely. Don't even, we, I don't even know what we're doing. I don't even know what a sirloin is. Indeed. Right. So my grub rub. Okay. I'm gonna put that in there. Now, how how many tablespoons did you put in? You know, I don't know. I didn't I didn't measure that out, Bill. So I'm not going to worry about that. that there was actually two. Two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. Okay, yes. Two tablespoons of Kistler Farms. How many how many pounds of meat? Two pounds, Bill. Two pounds of meat. Okay, two tablespoons for two pounds. Yeah, then I'm massaging the meat. Right. <laughs> how are we doing over here, Ron? I lost my Asian Bill, but I've still got my mashed potatoes. So. Sweet. Yes, and later I'm going to be adding some sour cream, some uh, jalapenos. Also known as jalapenos, yes. as we've uh, discovered before. Of course. And uh, some, I believe, some hot sauce, just for flavor. Because they are spicy mashed potatoes. Right. How are we doing with your meat? Potatoes. Um, you know, it's it's going good. I think. Now, how do you how do you know that it's thoroughly mixed? Because I am the meat rub expert. I am very proficient at rubbing meat, so I know when it's good to go. Okay. Don't worry about that. Okay. So, uh, I, do I need to make patties yet? So we're going to go ahead and add in two jalapenos, otherwise known as jalapeno. Now we de-veined and de-seeded one jalapeno, but left the veins and the seeds in the other, just to add a little bit of extra spice, but not too, too much. Yes. Okay. And then we... <laughs> Thank you, Ron. And then we also have a quarter cup of a special hot sauce. I'm unaware if we need to add the sour cream now. I, th I think we're, we're okay to add some sour cream. We're going to add the sour cream. I finished <laughs> rubbing my meat. Okay, two minutes later. I have uh, made my patties. I have five patties, two skillets, just so we can cook them at the same time. Can you hand me that spoon? We're gonna add some more sour cream to the I, mashed I like, potatoes. I like some sour cream. You like some sour cream? I'm not a huge fan, but. Well, that you're just not gonna like these as much then. This is my, this is my. Hey, what? No, 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 no! Are we rolling? <laughs> <laughs> We're rolling. Oh, okay. Well, like I was telling you, Ron, this is my plus two meat flipper. Okay. So no one can touch this but me. This is, is that out of the DMG? This is my equip. I yes. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, okay. so we have our burgers cooking up. You they know, look like big balls of meat, Nick. I'm going to flatten them, Bill. Okay. With my plus two meat flattener slash don't worry about it. <laughs> so anyways, flattening flattening my burgers. Now let me let me ask you a question. Yes. What what is the difference between cooking on the stovetop and cooking on a grill? You're asking me these questions, Bill, and all these things are running through my mind and I don't know what to say. Okay. But you know, there's 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 some there's some differences. I'm just gonna you know maybe give that a little turn. I'm gonna already. It up. No, I'm not. I'm going to turn that over again. So it's back on the other side. <laughs> what do you have to say about this, Ron? I, this has gotten out of hand. <laughs> I'm going to give these a little flip. Okay. You know, they've had a chance. When the meat lets go, doesn't let go of the pan. It means that the the proteins haven't yet heated up enough to you let know, go. You know, I, I can I can live with the how it is. 
Yeah, I can too. If you want it cooked to that color all the way through, you usually don't want too much pink. Now, as long as you get to 165 degrees, it'll kill off most of the bacteria, most of the dangerous stuff. What do you have to say about that? 165 degrees is the key. Yes. Okay, I... <laughs> Bill, what are you doing? Stop. My chest is gonna hurt. Spread the oil on the bun. We have this... Mmm, juicy burger. And, you know, it doesn't mean it's necessarily done, but if you look in there, the pink's all gone. So, you know, that, that is a well-cooked burger. We like the brown meat. We do like the brown meat. So are you going to rub the oil on the buns, or are oh, you just going to oh. keep nodding? <laughs> I guess, I guess. I have some buns just, here. Well, we're, we're going to toast We're gonna toast the buns, so in order to get a, a nice hard consistency on the buns, we're going to oil them up. <laughs> Leave it to the young do. chef to not be able to say <laughs> toast yeah. the buns without laughing. Yeah, right. We're going to toast the... Mmm. Yeah, that, I... Where are you going with that? We're going to turn this on a high heat. Okay. What we're going to do. Bam. We're going to oil them up. Now we used olive oil. Olive oil. What we're going to do is smack them down there. And what with the heat, this is actually going to toast the buns. With the oil on the buns. Toasty. Oily buns. Yes. Right there. Seriously? It's hot. Okay. It's gonna toast them. Now what we're gonna do is, Nick, if you'll hold that. <laughs> what do you have to say about that, Nick? Oh, I'm used to holding things. <laughs> like don't worry about that. <laughs> don't worry about it. Yeah, it's just it doesn't even matter. You want to wait? Actually, it, it's Bill, it's. When I grow up, I want to be just like you. It is pretty effing hot. Yes. Oh, that's, oh, that's, that's beautiful. That's, that's a good toast. That's a good toast right there. And... Oh, that is perfect. I can tell. Yes, ah, look at that. Out. Okay, go ahead and flop a burger on there. Flop, flop it. Flop, a burger. flop it. We've got a red onion. We've got tomato. And, of course, we have pepper jack cheese to put that on there. Oh, you know what? Actually, most... Most people will actually put the cheese on the burger while it cooks, but we, we don't know how to cook, so. So, yeah. So we'll go ahead and do it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> right? It's, it's the whole concept. We're, we're learning how to cook. And boom, I, okay, I, slap some, slap some uh, potatoes on there, some spicy smashed potatoes. I actually know how to cook. I'm just playing along, so. Uh, Whatever, dude. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. this is the meal. This is the, the, the finale. Okay, Nick, why don't you go ahead and take a bite of that burger first? Okay. That is our Grub Rub Burger. Mm. Is that oh. good? Is that awesome? Yeah. I, I'm sure you, you, you're able to actually lie on camera because... No, this is quite it, amazing. It is, it is quite amazing. It is. Awesome. I, um, well, I was going to say something highly inappropriate. But should, we, uh, <laughs> should we go ahead and feed you some... Uh, Awesome. That, oh my god, that's beautiful. It is. My mouth is aflame with <laughs> desire. Well said. I guess th this was another uh, episode of The Unchefs, and we appreciate your time. We hope you had fun. We did. Um, you didn't have fun? Once again, kisslerfarms.com. Kiss Check it out. Great products. Yep. And that's why we're here. Yep, you'll get seasonings, you'll get uh, recipes for some good food. So check it out, and we'll see you next time. Mm-hmm. <laughs>